Hello everyone welcome to Data Empires. In this session of data recovery training, we will discuss about the data recovery of the latest WD hard disk, named WD My Passport. Friends, the latest version of the WD My Passport hard disk is, Charger Family version. There comes many firmware related problems in the hard disks of this family. Generally, due to firmware problems, the hard disk is not detected in the system. And if it gets detected, then it performs very slowly due to which, the system gets hang. Many times the drive gets detected in the device manager, but it doesn't open in the disk management. When we open this hard disk casing, then we find this type of drive inside. A 3.0 USB connector is connected on the PCB, and this is the PCB of the hard disk. We have already discussed during electronic failure training that, in the hard disk of charger family, the MCU has been locked by the manufacturers. And therefore to get the backup of ROM and firmware in this hard disk, we require this type of unlocked SATA PCB. On this SATA PCB, the MCU is unlocked. And by using this PCB, we can take the backup of firmware by the help of advanced firmware tools. The price of this unlocked PCB is very high. Its cost ranges from $300 to $500. Companies working in the field of advanced firmware repairing require these PCB. If charger family hard disk is not getting detected, then for its detection, there is a need of advanced firmware work. But, if the hard disk is getting detected, and it is working slowly, or it is getting the system hanged, and hard drive drivers are not getting loaded, then in such cases, we can recover the data without SATA conversion and firmware repairing. In this training session, we will discuss about the data recovery from the charger family hard disks, having the problem of slow detection and system hang. Here, we have a hard disk of WD My Passport family. Now, let us connect it to the system, and understand the data recovery process. First of all connect this drive to USB 3.0 connector. Now open the device manager. WDSES device driver pending message appears here. Here we can see that WD My Passport 25E1 USB device is getting detected. Now open the disk management. Generally due to firmware issue, there comes a problem that, the disk management and data recovery software do not get open in the system. Here, the indicator light of hard disk is blinking. If the indicator light of the hard disk does not blink, and the hard disk does not get loaded in device manager, then we cannot recover the data with this technique. If the light blinks continuously, then we can easily recover the data without repairing the firmware. Here it is visible that, the disk management is not getting opened. And in such cases, it doesn't open even if we keep it connected for 2 to 3 hours. Now, run the UFS Explorer software. UFS Explorer is also not opening here. Now get this damaged drive disconnected from the system, and then check the system.
After disconnecting the drive, UFS Explorer gets opened and disk management also gets opened. Now let us recover the data in this case. First close the UFS Explorer software and keep open the disk management. Now again connect the hard disk to the system. The hard disk is getting proper power. The indicator light of the hard disk stops blinking. Now run UFS Explorer software. Now the software gets easily opened. Now try to explore the drive. Here, we can see all the data of the drive. Here, the indicator light of hard disk is blinking. If the hard disk is getting detected, and it is working slowly, or it is getting the system hanged, and hard drive drivers are not getting loaded, then in such cases, we can recover the data without SATA conversion and firmware repairing. In this way, we can easily recover the data from the charger series drive, without using any advanced firmware repair tool. For complete data recovery training, just log on to www.debtempires.com. Here you can learn all the course for lifetime in Hindi and English with one free data recovery solution. You can download all the resources easily without interruptions. Just subscribe once for a whole lifetime membership. We also offer best data recovery services for hard drive, SSD pen drive and server drives. And we are one of the leading manufacturers of mechanical data recovery tools and firmware software. For regular updates, you can also follow our social feed. Our RSS at datempires.com slash RSS. Our Twitter handle at at datempires. Our Facebook page at www.facebook.com slash datempires. Also, you can subscribe our YouTube channel by just pressing the bell icon on datempires channel.